Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Mina Maggie. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you like beauty videos. Um, today I am going to be doing my makeup for a date later tonight. So I want to be doing something sort of low-key glam, I suppose. So to start off, I'm going to go ahead and put my hair up. Also, if you hear that clicking, that is my dog walking around. So the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to take my Urban Decay Quick Fix and give myself a little spritz. While that is drying, I am going to go ahead and pull out my primer. And today I am going to be using MAC Prep and Prime. I did get this in my Ipsy bag for June. I'm going to go ahead and put that in my T zone. Alright, next thing I'm going to do is foundation. So I am going to go ahead and mix my Healthy Elixir. I love this for the summer, especially because it kind of gives you that dewy glow. And it's lightweight enough that it's not going to get all gross if it's hot out. And I am going to mix that with a little bit of my Urban Decay All Nighter Foundation. I'm just going to take my damp beauty blender and go ahead and start blending. Alright, next thing I'm going to do, I am going to take my concealer. Um, I have been thoroughly enjoying the Tarte Shape Tape, but who on this planet hasn't? And I'm just going to take a tiny bit, cover up that pimple. And once again, Beauty Blender. Okay, I did go ahead and change up the lighting or the angle just for lighting purposes. This is pretty, this is better. Okay. Real quick, I'm going to take my MAC Prep and Prime. I'm also going to spray this one more time. And I'm going to grab my Cody Airspun. I do get very bad smile lines and creases in my forehead from right there. So I'm going to bake that with pretty seriously as well. And then uh, with the excess, I'm just going to put it everywhere else. Okay. Next thing I'm going to do, I am going to be taking... I am wearing a basic black and white striped dress tonight. So I kind of want to do a little bit something extra with the eyes. Okay, to start off, I am going to be taking a blending brush and going in with the shade Coco in the Ciate London Pretty Fun and Fearless palette. I am just going to blend this right above my crease. Let's zoom you in a little bit. Next thing I'm going to do, because I do want to go with more of a pinky eye look tonight, I am going to go in with my Wet n, Wet n Wild palette in a not so basic bee, peach and grab this pink shade right here on just a slightly smaller 
on just a slightly smaller blunting brush, so like that. <laughs> okay, now on the even, I'm going to take a clean up blending brush and just make sure all of my edges are smooth and nice and blended. Take a very tiny angled brush like this and go in with the Huda Beauty Desert Dusk Palette and go in with this very pink shade here. Once again, blend it out. Okay, so with a little base down, I am taking the Stilla Magnificent Metal Eyes in the shade Kitten. This is the Okay, and now really quick with that first blending brush that we went in with, I'm going to go back and look with the color Coco and just kind of clean up any harsh lines. And to brush off bake. Do another spritz of Max Fix Pack Fix Plus. I'm going to do I'm going to go in with this hard candy bronzer in this shade party girl I'm going in with in the shade pearlescent pink this is a another wet n wild product I love how pigmented it is Going in with the Tarte Highlighters. This is a Skin Twinkle Volume 2. And a highlighter brush from um, AOA Studios. This is the F19. I believe I am going to go in, because I'm doing a more pinky look, I'll probably go in with this first shade, which is Daylight. I'm going to go in for brows. I'm going to be taking the Precisely My Brow by Benefit. I'm going to go in for brows. I'm going to be taking the Precisely My Brow by Benefit. Going to be taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Beverly Hills Clear Brow Gel just to set that in place. I'm taking going back to my buffing brush and just kind of I'm going to do I am going to take my Smashbox X-rated mascara. Next, what I'm going to do is a lipstick, and this is one of the final steps. I have the Wet n Wild Liquid Catsuit in the shade Pink Really Hard. I'm 
Uh, okay, you guys, this is the finished makeup look. Um, it's pretty kind of nightlifey, not too crazy. Um, so don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you like these kind of videos. Um, I will have some more videos coming back soon, so can't wait. See you guys later. Bye.